Is she being blocked? That is the question being asked today as we check in with V Shoujo's Kason, who is a major fan of the game Ark, and recently found out there had been a dedicated Ark streamer server set up, which she was surprised that she was just finding out about now. This particular server being mostly for first-person shooter content creators and VTubers, Kason would go on then to reveal information about her relationship with the VTuber agency Niji Sanji. Let's Let's take a listen. Who's making it? Arc streamer server? Who, who's making it? Why didn't I know it? <laughs> I don't know if you can... I, I don't think you can join since there's Niji Sanji. Oh, yeah, Niji Sanji hates me, so... They're not allowed to collab with me. Um, because they hate me, so... And I didn't do nothing, and they know it. That's horrible. <laughs> Sag. No offense to the VTubers, no offense to the talent, okay? But, I don't think it's a good thing to, you know, try to kick out some individual because... Yeah, that ain't cool. That ain't cool. That's just straight up bullying, I think. But no offense to any of the VTubers there, okay? It's just the system that I'm complaining about, alright? No offense to any of the VTubers, because... They're not the ones wanting to do that. The company is doing that. Um, yeah, hopefully. Hopefully times will change. Hopefully. Yeah. They say it's because of the political sh**. But I've never said anything political before and everyone knows that. That's a made-up story. Made by the people who hate me. And... They did that because they hate me. <laughs> and everyone knows that. But they're scared of him, and that's why they can't collab with me. And... I mean, really, I'm, I'm gonna say this a ton of times. No offense to any of the talents there. No offense. Because they are being so nice to me secretly. Even if, they're, if their company tell them not to, not to do anything with me, they secretly, like, message me how nice I am, how... How wonderful I am, and I have no offense to them. I, I really love them, okay? They're so nice. I have nothing against their talent. I mean, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna tell who did it, but they use their private accounts to contact me. Yeah, so I, I don't know, so that the company wouldn't know, I think. And they said how much they respected me and how much they love my content. So um they're so nice. They're company people, so they can't just, you know, <laughs> they have their rules. And I respect that, but, you know, but if they know that I haven't done nothing and they're still doing that, I think that is. And I'm just in, I'm just, you know, just a, just someone <laughs> here doing whatever I want. Just an individual. Now that's, I think that is just straight up bullying. But when it comes down to business... Now everything matters, and I hate that! But when it comes to business, everything matters, and even if it's not true, they gotta pretend like they hate me. And that is very sad, but that is the truth. But I still love them, because they love me too. No one hates me. <laughs> and this is weird, right? No one hates me. <laughs> Nobody. Not even the company. But they have to. Because business. I stay positive. Like in five years, this is gonna go away. Don't worry! It's gonna go away in five years. It just takes time. So once again, a complicated relationship between Kason and Niji Sanji, the company, saying at the end, even they don't hate her, but it's just business, and that she does not feel that that thinking reflects the thinking of the Niji Sanji talents. However, who Kason is collabing with is Giri, the cooking VTuber, now in Japan, and gone fishing with Kason, like on a boat and everything, leading to fan art such as this, as the two have quite the catch. As also now, Giri is celebrating one 
101,000 followers on Twitch.tv, receiving this celebratory artwork from Ham, and Kason has another collab planned, that with Project Melody of Vishojo, which is actually being planned as an off collab. That's right, Melody is on her way to Japan, with Kason relaying that Melody's plane had been delayed, but now that herself, Giri, and Melody are planning another fishing trip together. That all while Vishojo's Amamiya Nazuna would call Kason's room messy, all while the two could also be seen here together, with Kason remarking, giving fingers even if it's too tiny to notice. That being from this two-year anniversary V Shoujo video, created by Kana Uru, saying I was in charge of the V Shoujo anniversary video, I did my usual thing and made it silly and cute, please enjoy. Seafoam Boy would add, I was commissioned to model these chibi versions of V Shoujo girls quite a while ago. These designs based off of Lin at Mamechi's original designs, crediting Kana Uru and Seafoam Boy while also saying thank you for the opportunity. As Kason replied, these little guys are too cute and adorable. And just before this recording, V Shoujo has released yet another animated lore video and promising even more, while at the same time releasing two-year anniversary merchandise drawn up by illustrator Akagi, saying let's all celebrate this wonderful anniversary together. And also marking the anniversary was a V Shoujo cover song featuring seven of the original talent singing zombies, with the zombie illustrations themselves coming from Alex at Maple Keurig. That is, we now check in with V Shoujo's Fruit, now revealing her brand new model. Let's take a look. Yes, it's Fruit 2.0 asking, want beans on toast? As Project Melody reacted with Son of a Lich, she's so cute. The new model offers plenty of new expressions. And once again, Brian Chewy of Iron Vertex has returned, providing the rigging on Fruit's new model, all while Meriwether Media provided yet another lore video, this time being a very colorful collaboration between Minister Duke and Das Doctor, along with a brand new merch drop, including a body pillow cover which we can't show the back of on YouTube. And once again, if you're interested in merch, feel free to check out our merch drop with Uwu Market, including the hat and mug. And next with V Shoujo, we also have Zentrea, showing off her new Commander Zentrea 2022 look and saying, I apologize in advance, but I am going to be messing with my hair a lot now. That as Kuen at Koloi Impetsu gave us the references for this new Commander look, including the official references, as well as the scrapped concepts. That is next as we check in with Oh Hey, It's Big Zam, showing off this mechanized Zentrea, complete with 3D modeling. And speaking of 3D, we are back with cosplayer Homura, giving us this cyberpunk Zentrea with light. And yes, Zentrea also took part in the Zombies cover, later saying, everybody is calling me a Vocaloid now, and receiving in reply, not true, they can sing. That supportive remark coming from the VTuber bartender Takahata, whose collaboration stream with Twitch TV2, is set for its final episode tonight at 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern. Keep your eyes open, you might see someone familiar. And speaking of familiar, it's Nichi Sanji's Miyu, here with a brand new banner on her YouTube page, and now with her Twitter account removed, as she has graduated, much to the dismay of Azura. But the fans will still remember this Otter VTuber, with Are Fusio saying the first time I was dragged down the rabbit hole was priceless. All while we have this Let's Meet Again Someday Somewhere artwork, and we do have more reactions in Niji Sanji, including Etna Crimson saying, I'm a cry all night. Nasera saying, My eyes hurt. Shu Yumino giving a peace sign alongside Yugo Asuma. And while Hiona would give the middle finger, she would also illustrate this going away artwork saying, This is all I could muster for now. It's a bit hard to draw when you got tears in your eyes. And Alouette would say, I'm crying. I missed Miyu's Tatsumachi. And Nina Kosaka would remark, Graduations are tough to watch. That is Hall Live. Indonesia's Crazy Ali would say, wishing you all the best, leader. And yes, we can neither confirm nor deny that Miyu's very last tweet simply read, PISS. Which now brings us over to Niji Sanji English's Millie Parfait, whose hat is only getting bigger, as Lost Little One is taking us all on quite the journey. And the hat has not only covered up Millie, but also Niji Sanji HQ, the Earth, and possibly soon the entire solar system. This while Millie took to Twitter to say, hat's dead, I stuffed it in my booba. Along with, sorry guys, closing my OnlyFans because the only interest I see in my replies is my hat. But one TikTok page receiving interest 
interest is this one, masquerading as Millie Parfait and reposting work from other clippers. This all while we check in with Niji Sanji English Official, officially releasing Etheria new outfit goods made to order until December 18th, while also soon offering up birthday merchandise for Maria Marionette, Petra Gurin, and Selene Tatsuki for their birthdays, with Selene's birthday being today. As this competitive dragon received brand new artwork from her character illustrator and has been featured at the Animate storefront in Akihabara, complete even with a custom introduction video by Selene wherein she calls herself toxic. Today she's been anything but that. Earlier saying, my birthday is getting closer and just want to say thank you dragoons for sticking with me for this long and I'm so nervous prepping for the streams that I had a little cry. Thanks for always supporting me and enabling me to do these dumb ideas and content. With Selene also offering us this gift, saying a year has passed already and it's now my second year celebrating my birthday with you dragoons. My first gift to you is a 3D print file of your very own dragoon with Sierra revealing I was commissioned by Selene to make a dragoon 3D print file. It's out now and you can download and print it yourselves and customize it however you like. And regarding her upcoming original song, Selene revealed that she has delayed its release until next year. Having received back the music video and being so impressed that she now wants to improve her own vocals for the video. Even now asking Niji Sanji management for more vocal coach lessons. And lastly today with Niji Sanji, we turn to Hanamakia saying just a silly little video. Don't worry about this tweet. Keep scrolling and then providing the date of December 1st saying later, damn, this was supposed to be a small little baby reveal. I didn't expect so much support. Thank you. And lastly, who is asking for support is Chibi, the cyber girl VTuber tweeting out, um, my newest YouTube video got removed for a violation of guidelines. Team YouTube harassment and cyberbullying. What? Help. Way to ruin my night. I reacted to a YouTube video on your site, dude. YouTube, please. And now I have to worry about not being able to post for a week hypothetically. I don't even cuss or say anything lewd. I'm like a golden child. Please review my video, YouTube. Adding chat, this is like 1984. Haha, <laughs> right guys. It's either humor at this point or a mental breakdown. And later reporting, Team YouTube, you denied my appeal and say that I am in fact cyberbullying, harassing, very confused and disheartened with YouTube saying we've reviewed the video and confirmed that it violates our harassment policies. Specifically around three minutes in, Chibi would go on to post that part of the video on Twitter with her simply reacting to a number of meme videos saying beyond horrified that they can just make false claims and I have to be okay with it. Any support on YouTube at all would mean the world. I've already been struggling with the algorithm. This just makes everything so much harder. I manage everything on my own. I don't have a team of support or guidance. I don't really have anything outside of my editors and you guys, so I'm really scared. There, however, is something, or should we say someone, helping Chibi get through this. As the Cyber Girl would also say, Nintendo has to know what they're doing. Making Bowser so hot, right? We're all thinking it, right? We're all barking and drooling, right? <laughs> right, guys? <laughs> then leading to this Bowser is Love fan artwork, that by way of V. Yugen's Uni, giving us this just Chibi and Bowser, with the VTuber replying, this is the best drawing ever. This is my entire personality now. I'm getting this tattooed on my billboard forehead. And that is all for this episode. As always, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe below. Send your VTuber news to our Discord. We record live on Twitch, and we'll have more. Things VTubers say for you soon.